I don't know, I think I'm going to go with the Guardians, just because of that, because it feels like there's less people there, and I do like being the underdog at times. So, I'm going to go with the Guardians. Alright, here we go. Here's the character creation screen. Three races. Got the Dwarf, the High Elf, and the Mathosian, which I think is just, you know, the human. <laughs> Let's look at the racial abilities. Motivational Raw increases movement speed and nearby group members by 30% for 10 seconds. Really nice racial ability. Not bad at all, especially for PvP. On, I, I guess that would be very good. Also Dexterity 10, not bad at all. And Death Resistance increased by 20. Wait, are they any different for... No, they're not different for, for the genders. Alright, here's a uh, High Elf. Angelic Flight flies towards select area, cannot be used in combat. I actually made a high elf and, and really like this ability. It's very good, it's very fun. It has like 50 second cooldown, so I was constantly using it. Wisdom, I'm not sure what class uses Wisdom. I think Cleric uses one because I made a Cleric. Life Resistance, 20, oh, very good. Let's see what's this, Density. Dwarves can fall twice the distance of other races. Doesn't seem that good. But they get strength 10 and uh, water resistance has increased. So, hmm. Let's look at the female ones. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Alright. This one's not bad. Should I go with a female one or a male one? I mean, a male one doesn't... It's just... It just looks weird. It's not like a gremlin. I don't quite like that look. I mean, the human... Or, sorry, the Methosian looks fine. The dwarf looks fine. Well, dwarfs aren't supposed to look, you know, intimidating. But still, this is the only one that really appeals. Or this one, but I like the racial one on this a lot better. I'm gonna go with an elf because of the racial. You'll see why. I okay, damn loved it. All right, so as a as an elf, you get plus ten in wisdom, which increases, I think, mana regeneration. So elves would make great mages or clerics. With that jump ability. I think I'm going to go with the cleric this time as well, because I already know some of the uh, some of the souls and got acquainted with it. So let's go with it. Let's look at the character creation here. I kind of like this because it's very easy to use. You can just drag this thing around, sort of changes the features. I think I, I don't think you can actually make elves ugly. Let's see, let's just randomize this. Nah. It's just not possible. You can't really fuck it up, can you? But you get the idea of what sort of uh, looks you can get. No, this is not possible. Let's look at. I just want to. I just want to quickly see the uh, <laughs> female dwarves. Let's see. Yeah, let's look at this. Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, they're all tiny. about the uh, human one. Well, there's more variety here, I think. Maybe it's just me, but it feels like there's more variety here in the looks department. Let's quickly look at the, uh, the male ones. Very basic looks. Very simple. 
Uh, let's, let's take a closer look at the uh, what you can actually change. Um, well, here's, I already showed this thing, which is very easy to use. Just sort of move around until you find your look. And you're like, yeah, that's alright. And you got the features, which is kind of like the shadows on the face. I'm not sure if it actually changes the... Uh, no, I don't think it changes anything except the texture on the face. Uh, determines the shadows. All right, and you got your eye color, your scale of the eye, so you, can <laughs> so you have these bug eyes if you want to. I get a really tiny one, so it look like a villain. And uh, you got this. Oh, you can make it really sad or really, really, really Chinese. I don't know. This is weird. All right, and you got your eyebrows. Uh, there's a good selection. Thirteen different ones. Well, twelve actually. 13 one doesn't have any so all right you got your nose only two sliders his eyes and the tilt you can make him pig man and you got your mouth <laughs> of course make it as big as possible and uh, then you got your hair well he doesn't have hair right now and uh, let's just give him some hair and you got your base color and your highlight color so say you want to have blue highlights and green hair it's very possible let's look at the hairs, there's nine different ones or well, eight if, unless you count balds as a hairstyle got your typical ponytails alright and uh, got marking colors different types of markings. I think every every race there's some type of markings. Some sort of tattoos for their face. Wait, there's no pure black colour for it. Alright. Now facial hair is, f is here as well, so make him look really old and uh, and skin skin colour as well, so really basic stuff and uh, then you got your height if you want to be really big so everyone aggros you in PvP they're like look at that big guy let's attack him take him down quickly or if you want to make a really small guy so no one can see you try and sneak up on people alright well I'm not gonna make this guy just sort of wanted to test them out 